Hello there everybody, my name's Waddles and welcome to the Majestic Cool Turtle Guide. Today I'm going to go over the turtle, the drops, and everything about the turtle. This video is coming thanks to Tiger Eye. Thanks for leaving the comment saying, Turtle Guide please. Here you go. If you want to see another update aquatic guide before the update comes out, or I guess after, drop a comment down below, tell me what it is, because I'm not very good at reading minds. The best place to start is probably where to find the turtles. The turtles spawn, according to the Wikipedia page, on warm beaches. Turtles have a lot of health. They have 15 hearts. So if I kill this poor turtle for science, of course, he takes five hits to kill with the diamond sword. Now, turtles really will only drop scoot. However, when you kill them, they could drop zero to two seagrass, but I mean, that's not that interesting. So the scoot, how do you get that? That drops when the baby turtle grows into an adult turtle. So kind of an interesting drop mechanic, very different. You can't get the scoot from just slaughtering turtles. That is not going to do you any good. You're just going to feel bad. Now, what can you use the scoot for? You can use it for really a couple of things. With five scoot, you can make a turtle shell. You could also use a scoot to make the potion of the turtle master. Then you can put that effect on an arrow as well. So you can shoot that effect at things. Now the turtle shell. It acts as a helmet. You can put it on. When you put it on, you get 10 seconds of water breathing. So if we switch over into survival so we can see our oxygen, we will not lose any air bubbles for 10 seconds. Once the 10 seconds passes, we will start to lose air just like normal here, right there. That's just going to start going down slowly. So the 10 seconds of air that it gives you is pretty valuable. It's cool. And to re-get that 10 seconds of air, you need to pop back above the surface and go back under. So if you make an air pocket somewhere and you go into it and then you leave it, you get 10 more seconds of air. For some reason, mobs hate the turtle. More specifically, the baby turtle and the eggs. The mobs that will attack baby turtles are right here. Zombie variants, so husk, drowned, zombie villager, zombie. Skeleton variants, so wither skeleton, stray, and the normal skeleton. And then the ocelot and the wolf. These mobs do not like baby turtles, and they don't like turtle eggs either. Now, according to the Wikipedia page, zombies will seek to destroy the turtle eggs, but this guy doesn't seem to really care for some reason, so I don't know. I mean, I am in a snapshot, and I know I have seen these guys kill turtle eggs before. Maybe it's something to do with me being in creative. Now, turtle eggs take a little while to hatch. Once they hatch, something interesting happens. Let's pretend this turtle hatched from that egg right there. So the egg's gone, turtle hatched. Pretending this turtle is the baby turtle, this beach right here is now this turtle's home beach. What that means is that whenever you breed this turtle, it will come back and lay its eggs on the beach where it hatched. Of course, how do you get a turtle to lay an egg? You take seagrass and you feed it to two of them. They'll do their whole little walking into each other thing, and then one of them will go over and start to dig somewhere. Whenever it feels like it found the right spot. Come on. Oh, there we go. That one's digging right there. So then the egg will be laid right there. And again, it'll grow up, hatch, and that'll be the home beach. So if you don't pick these eggs up with silk touch and take them somewhere else to let them hatch, you're going to have a small problem farming these guys. <laughs> Not to plug my own videos too much, but there is a tutorial on this channel for a scoot or turtle farm. That's all of the information I had for you on the turtle today. I hope I didn't miss anything. If I missed something important, go throw it down below so everyone can see it. If you want to see another guide on a 1.13 stuff, whether it's before or after, drop that down below as well. Now's the best time, if you haven't yet, to drop a like, subscribe, and then go have a good day. My name is Waddles. I will see you next time. Goodbye, everybody.